I've got Alan Smith alongside me today. I'm Martin Tyler, incidentally, and we've got Major League Soccer for you. And uh, in the, the US, the game really growing, Alan. I'm looking forward to this very much. Oh, so am I, Martin. So am I. For you today, we have Toronto against Kansas City. we're focusing on I think with good reason there's a lot of quick players about but uh, it's not always easy to use that speed but this boy has mastered that to a T so this is how the hosts line up today this is the way they like to play isn't it and it does allow them with three at the back to have two main attackers up front which is a little bit unusual these days well you look at that formation you could interpret it as being a little negative especially if that holding midfielder in front of the back three doesn't venture too far forward but uh, an onus on the wide men as well to support those two lads up front this is the away team lineup 4-3-3 and they've got natural wide players in that front three with a central striker I think that's the key because those lads on the flanks it's quite a complicated job actually because they've got to come inside support the centre forward and they've also got to funnel back when they haven't got the ball so an onus on them Alvaro Aldgate takes charge of this game Off we go with the kickoff. Espinosa. Really trying to win possession here. They've got the ball rolling again straight away. Cross coming in now. That was a good crossing position, but not a good cross. Cooper. It's looking good, this move. And in goes the cross. Shots on here. That's well, well wide. Sebastian Jovinko. Good forward play from them. Jovinko! Wonderful save. Had to really reach out for that. Well, they know their positions here. They know their jobs defending this corner. Well, they've had a go at goal following the corner. I don't know whether it was rehearsed, Alan. <laughs> it didn't quite look right. Well, it, whether it was rehearsed or not, it wasn't a bad effort, and it didn't miss by much. Josie Altidore. Played down the wing, keeping the wide attack going. Maybe the cross. And now the shot! That's a good try. Beat the goalkeeper, beat the post.
Osorio. Cooper. Sebastian Jovinko. To Osorio. Building steadily here, keeping possession. Really on top of their game now. Wonderful. Out it all! Oh, looking for that first-time finish. Well, all the best strikers are very adept at that kind of thing, and he's not bad, but didn't quite pull it off there. Attacking well here. Here comes the cross. Well, he took no chances there. It's a corner. One more look back at that effort from Josie Altidore. Well, a chance spurned there without question. Although a bit unlucky that the post got in the way. Well, the corner is... And it's a header. Super stop by the goalkeeper. And he's hung on to the ball as well. Josie Altidore. Michael Bradley. Cooper attacking now. Not according to plan. Espinosa. Did well, stuck out a foot and cut off the pass. Now Osorio. In quickly. Really trying to use the full width of the pitch here to make some progress. Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. To take the lead. And this time, yes, they do score. Well, it's been coming. And they've been playing well enough to deserve this goal. Nicely created. Well finished. And very well merited. Well, the unpredictability of football, because... No one would have called this really, and the team has risen to the occasion, and they've got a goal to show for their considerable efforts. Yeah, and it was a good goal as well, and uh, it came at the end of a good passage of play, so they'll get a real lift from that. And that has opened the scoring, 1-0 here. Moving forward with some danger to the opposition, now they're here. And shoots! Fine save he's made there. And he's not let the ball escape his grasp. Sebastian Jovinko. And the board shows three added minutes. Looking for an opening with some good control builder. And in goes the cross. Through pass. Crisp defending there. Well, the referee has signaled for half time, and it's 1 0 here. Well, the player that we're featuring here has done well. He's certainly been an influence on this first half. Well, he played really well didn't he and he got himself a goal to put his team so here we go for the second half well, that is a cheap piece of play to give the ball away like that could be dangerous real chance well he scored and it's a big moment for them in the match. They've pushed their lead now to two ahead. They've played well to this point, but sometimes a two-goal lead can be a dangerous one. We'll see. Well, he knew exactly where the goalkeeper was going. 
and he just steered it past him into the bottom corner. Yeah, he's a fine finisher, this boy, and uh, never panics, passes it into that corner. Starting at 2 0. Good forward play from them. Substitute coming up for the away team. Defender to it first. Intercepted well. They've coped with it well defensively. And here's the shot. He's had to go full stretch. Sebastian Jovinko. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. It could be a chance. Osorio. Well, we've got an angle on this uh, offside call, Alan, I must say, it is the most difficult thing in all the officiating, I think. But this assistant has got eagle eyes. Well, I certainly wouldn't want to do that job because uh, the uh, speed that players move now, as it turns out, what a great call. Toronto will get a free kick. To Osorio. Some players limbering up for the away team. Substitution in the offing. Chance from the pass. Saw the goal and went for it. It's a fine strike, but not quite what he was hoping for. But well, when he's hit it, I'm sure he would have thought that was going to bulge in the back of the net. Not quite, though. Cooper was good progress with this attack well he's cleared the danger and that will be a corner for Toronto no apologies for focusing on this fella well the goalkeeper will be hoping his defenders can close him down a bit quicker because he has been peppering them in and scored Chance here, chance taken by Toronto, they've scored. How about that goal for sheer class? Well, it was such a beautifully delivered corner that uh, you just felt it was going to end up with a goal. given them a comfortable situation here 3-0 as the game gets underway just a quick check on the clock and there are 20 minutes to go well when they do say and you've been in these matches about the psychology of getting it right on the big day you would have thought ability wise it's uh, very much a level pegging here but in fact one side seems far more up for it than the other yeah, I think that does seem to be the case, whether the one manager has uh, pumped up his players, got them ready, better than his opposite number, that seems to be the case at the moment. Attacking well here.
Really trying to use the full width of the pitch here to make some progress. Now the countdown is to 10 minutes left. There's some potential in this move. Doing well to keep the ball. They put that cross far too close to the goalkeeper. He's known as a fine passer of a football, and he's right on. It's a quick break. Shots on here. Very good stop here. Decision is a corner for Toronto. Well, this is where substitutes are important. Who and when. So now a goal kick to come. Morrow, quick header, found a teammate. He's coming forward with some danger. Shots up, and this is a goal. Down low and well out of the reach of the goalkeeper. Neatly done. Oh, it's another fine goal, and uh, the keeper, who's had to pick the ball out the net, he's had a miserable time, as have the losing side here. Pretty straightforward this match. And the late goal sums it up, really. Yeah, they've just compounded their superiority with that one. Another angle on it here. It's turning out to be a, a comfortable game, this 4-0. And the fourth official has held up the board to say four more minutes. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. The shot's on! Well, it's a massive margin of victory here. That victory confirmed by the final whistle. 4-0, the final score. Well, at times you thought they got a bit greedy, but why not? I mean, if you're on top of an opponent like they were here today, rub it in. Well, they did. They were ruthless, weren't they? They rubbed their faces into the dirt. And uh, this is the hallmark of the top side.